What's up guys? Welcome back for the next episode of Gone Home. So in this one we might as well go check out the attic because it's right there and it's all red and stuff and it told me not to go up there but obviously I have to go up there. So yeah, let's go up there. Open the attic. Ah, it's locked! Shit! Alright. <laughs> Spoiler! <laughs> Spoiler warning! It's totally locked! Alright, um... Alright, let's go back downstairs and take a look at stuff and things and all that jazz. See if we missed anything. I'm just like leaving all these doors and shit open as I'm walking through the house. Looks like somebody like ransacked the house. Straight up. Straight up. Alright, yeah, there's a bunch of stuff I didn't explore here. In this apart episode section. Yeah. That's locked. Everything's locked. Alright, uh to the basement is locked. Where have I uh music room. Let's go to the music room. That's quickly as we can nice transition yeah seriously i try to i try to transition when you are there to see behind the scenes yeah, <laughs> yeah it happens it happens it happens all right so let's take a look through this music room that i didn't walk all the way through for some reason we're gonna go to this attic just kidding totally not gonna go in the <laughs> attic because that attic is totally locked like it's a fucking oops Read the letter. Okay, Sam. Samantha, please give this to your mother. And Janice, thank you for having Danny over to your new house. He has missed having his friend Samantha in the neighborhood very much. Danny asked if he could lend Samantha his his Nintendo Street Fighting tape. <laughs> and I gave my permission. He needs to spend less time on those games. Anyway, no hurry returning it. Let Samantha know that she is welcome back to our home or house to visit anytime. Thanks. When you live in one place your whole life, your next door neighbor is kind of like your default friend. And Daniel only got weirder over the years. So moving away has been a good excuse to, like, not see him anymore. Damn, that's mean. But he did always have the good Nintendo games. Maybe I'll give him a call. Yeah, okay. So yeah, where do I go now? <laughs> where? What are you doing right now? Rocked the I'm man. I'm upstairs, looking uh, into the fans room. Oh. I already went through there. Uh, so when are you going to stream us going in the dark zone in the division? Um, probably never, because I stopped playing the division. <laughs> uh, Rockman needs a theme song, just saying. Oh, Rockman's got a theme, theme song. song. Oh, he's got a theme song. <laughs> I need a theme song. Apparently you need a theme song. <laughs> uh, okay. Lay it on me. What is it? Oh, I have no clue what you're- You have to come up with your theme song. I'm not gonna come up with your theme song. You just said you already have a theme song for me, so whatever. Well, no, you have a theme song. Okay, what is it? No, you- I don't know. It's your theme song. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> <laughs> Where's- I'm looking for, like- I don't know, some kind of a freaking a key or something, or a combination lock, or something like Trogdor. Trogdor! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, have you found a, uh, like, combination for the combination locker in, uh... No, I've been looking. It would be age because my gear score is 225, so uh, it will put you in the 201 plus bracket. Yeah, no thanks. I'm good. I'm good. I get totally destroyed and wrecked on all of the levels. Um, ooh, an emery board. What's Panda's gear at? I know she plays that game. Like, like. Is she really? is she still playing? I don't know. Hey, uh, I don't know. Hey, Godmod, is uh, is Panda still playing Division, or did she like totally give up like she said she was going to? I bet she gave up. It's in a folder. It's in a folder? Well, I, I got the combo lock for the... the actual drawer in uh, the cabinet for uh, the dad's office, 0451. But... Yeah. I didn't get the other one. If there is another one, there should be another one. She has platinum, so I doubt it. Yeah, yeah, 
She did say she was kind of done after the Platinum rant. Let's read this slip. Not a challenging assignment. Metal plaque for family portrait. Reasonable subject, but not complex. When I said uh, mom and dad should be replaced with parents' names, I did not mean just add them underneath. Blah, blah, blah. Got it. Alright, I have no idea where this thing is. is it, what, is it 0451? I... Nope, that's that's totally not it. That's uh that is a no. It's not even how these combination locks work. What? Get out of here, game. <laughs> I mean I could see it with, you know, the one in dad's office. I I get that. But not that. That one you can like do the twisty twisty thing. You do the twist and shout thing with the lock. Yeah, it's six nine six nine. Oh yeah, is it six nine six nine? I'm I'm trusting you, God Mod. I'm trusting you. <laughs> don't tell what me that. If it's not it? Don't, don't tell me. To I, I, don't, I don't know something. I'm gonna do something. He he he's not gonna know. It's not six nine six nine. Oh God Mod, I'm I don't trust you anymore. Disappointed in you. I'm so disappointed. <laughs> Your mother and I are so disappointed in you, Godmon. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> Godmon. This guy. This guy. He's, he's a master troll. Right here. Troll. <laughs> Found a sea of passage. What? In the closet? No way. I'm just gonna leave that water on. <laughs> <laughs> Turn that water on. Just walk off. Like I don't give a fuck. It's another button. Heavens to Betsy. Can I do something with these buttons? I like these buttons. Pirates are... Are Kai sucked? Oh, Cali sucked. Yeah, I would imagine. It's California. California kind of sucks. Alright. There you go. You get a button. I have no idea where I'm going. Rockman, did you find anything yet? I found a secret passageway. What? Secret passageway? Yeah. Where you is it? You have to go where the... Uh... Sewing room is? Oh, it's upstairs. Yeah. Yeah. To the sewing room. Slowly. <laughs> <laughs> Walk. Don't run. Yeah, seriously. Zans, guess what? What? I swear to God, if you say chicken butt, I'm done with you. Done with you. All right. Secret. Room. Is there a button? Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's so creepy. Full screen. Whoa. <laughs> Where's the secret? Where's the secret? It know doesn't what? look like it's there, but you have, to, you have to press it on the wall. Oh my god. Press I know, it right? on the wall. In Inside the sewing room. No, you have to find the, the thing. It doesn't matter. It says, I found out secrets. And then you go to the, your mom's and father's closet. And it's in there. You can see on the map, it'll be pink. Highlighting pink. Where's the freaking? Where's the thing that says I found a whatever? You found the secrets. Yeah. Yeah. Where is it? I'm going back. Oh I don't know where it was when oh I found my it. God. Is it in the folder? Hey. Maybe. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. There it is. <laughs> Holy crap! I was in the library. I noticed something in the corner. I found a secret passage, and it had Oscar's creepy old stuff in it. Oh my god! Oh my god! I have to see this. We're skipping. Secret passage marked. Okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. 
It wasn't in the folder because I had a thing on top of the folder. I just hit my mic. Sorry. Apologies. Too excited, obviously. I found out it's I a don't waste of around. <laughs> Why did I do this? This guy. <laughs> All right, where's the secret room? Open panel. Okay, we got secrets, folks. Really? You turn off the lights because I picked up a fucking cross? Ooh, look at the stuff. Matt. <laughs> not even turning on. <laughs> Hidden compartments found. Three. Library upstairs. Hall. Foyer. Evidence of the supernatural. Discovered zero. Okay. So. Yeah. It tells me where God, it is. That's cool. Scared. scared the hell out of me. It's hella dark and shit. Is there more to see? Oh. Oh, yeah. Another panel to open. Ooh, I'm inside the, uh, I'm inside uh, the, the, the thing. Nice. Alright, let's see here. Okay. So, that goes from upstairs to downstairs. Got it. There it is. There's what? Got a thing. Show flyer. At Todd's brother's place after the show, there was only a futon to sleep on, so Lonnie and I shared it. The lights went out. I was turned toward her. My eyes started to adjust, and then I could see she was looking at me, too. In the dark, she smiled. My heart was beating so fast. I rolled over. I felt so, I don't know, nervous? After a minute, she put her arm around me and was so close and whispered in my ear, I really like you. Oh, how sweet. I just nodded my head and I really hope she could tell. I really hope that she meant what I think she did. I felt like a shook up can of soda ever since. I hope we have the chance to talk before I explode. <laughs> Day 47, still trying to figure out what this game is. <laughs> <laughs> Morale is low. <laughs> yeah, mor Morale is low, but I will persist. <laughs> but I will carry on. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, I got the second half of the combo for Sam's Locker. Five. Oh. One. All right, so that's just the story and shit. All right, let's go look for the other secret stuff. We gotta go back upstairs. So let's go take the secret passage. So, not gonna lie, when I have a house of my own, I'm totally gonna have secret passages. It's gonna be <laughs> awesome. <laughs> How do you get to the bathroom? Well, thousands of mirrors. <laughs> <laughs> There's gonna be revolving bookcases and all sorts of shit. It's gonna be what awesome. <laughs> it's gonna be so cool. No, we do work. And there's the other part of the combination. Really? Got a Ouija board. A Ouija board. And One. Hello. Note. Two. Oscar. Three. What do you want? Ba to come back. Come back. <laughs> Oscar wanted ba to be a sheep in his life. I get it. <laughs> that's that's cool. What was it one? There you go. Booyah. Hey. Kodo. We got a photo as Lonnie. Lonnie I'll take that came key. over today. But everything was different. She was what? sitting at my desk chair, <laughs> and she wouldn't look at me. Oh, Finally, I asked her what was going on. She said she felt like oh. she'd done something wrong that night in the city. On the, on the like I must think. But I said no. There was nothing wrong. I just wanted to say... But I couldn't find the words. I felt like I was gonna cry, but Basement. I wasn't sad. She got up and sat next to me on the bed. I looked at her. Lonnie. Do you think you c 
could ever... And that's when she kissed me. <laughs> oh, how sweet. Did you open the locker? Mm-hmm. Okay, so you're heading towards the basement? No, I'm still up top. I'm in the basement. I'm about to grab the freaking key. Grab the key. And I, I pulled... listen. Yeah, well, I just pulled a string. Yeah. Pull another string. Deal with it, nerd. Ooh, potato chips. Man, I want some chips. <laughs> some potato chips sound really nice right now. Samantha plus It's Lonnie. different now. Ooh, it's getting you saucy. Know, still hang out all the time like before. But now when no one else is around. Well, you know, so you Down could the say we're dating, but it's secret. Secret dating? Secret dating. I don't know. I mean, I guess that's the real difference. Now when we get off the phone or go home for the night, or it's just quiet and we're alone, we say I love you. They're secret dating. Let's see. Below are two stories. The events are all out of order. Blah, blah, blah. Menstrual cycle Katie, stuff please. stuff. please. Whatever you found, don't tell mom and dad. The attic. Oh, yeah. First place blue ribbon in science? I, I have no Nerd. idea. Just, I just, there's just an atom. Yeah. <laughs> Is this? I assume that's science. I assume that's always science. Whenever I see that, I assume it's generic representation of science. Furnace. Everett. Everett Furnace. Lee Everett. Aw, Lee! <laughs> Sorry, having, fla having flashbacks to <laughs> The Walking Dead. <laughs> <laughs> Right. I'm so college stupid and stuff. sometimes. I was telling Lonnie that I got into my college summer program thing, and I was all making plans like, you should come visit me, stay in my dorm room. But she said, Sam, I ship out on June 6th. I was like, ship out? To where? She said, to basic training. What did you think I was doing all that ROTC stuff for? I guess she's been planning to join the army right after high school since she was like 12. And oh, I guess she's nice. really going to do that it. Nice home alone. So I was <laughs> like, after graduation, I'm just never going to see you again? She said, let's just have fun while we can. I did not see the uh, season three teaser for uh, Walking Dead, by the way. I actually didn't even finish. Uh... Uh, what was it? The season two. It's on my to-do list. <laughs> <laughs> like streaming more games. Yeah. Playing yeah. more games. Yeah, basically, yeah. It's, it's all interactive with your followers. Hey man, hey man. I'm totally interactive with my followers. Look at me talking to Godmod. What's up, Godmod? <laughs> you never said anything. It's like forever. <laughs> That's bullshit. It's because I've been listening to fucking stuff and narration. Okay, so what did you say? What did you say right now? Tell me what he said. I finished season two. They tell you to stick with the group on field trips, Katie. He also said saucy. There's a reason for that. Lonnie and I snuck off on the side paths at Multnomah Falls and got a little lost. Okay, a lot lost. Like, for hours. Right before the bus left, we found a trail and came running down the path, soaked and covered in mud, shouting for the bus not to leave. The school called home. Mom and Dad said, you didn't get into trouble like this before you met that Lonnie girl. But I don't think they know, no, about us. The kids at school, though, I'm really afraid that's a whole other story. Stick with the group, Katie. Stick with the group. All this narration. It's a lot of a lot of messy writing. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Ta 
Todd's band so much narration. Singer. Todd said he sucked. Lonnie said he got sick of Todd's shit. And he was complaining about needing a new singer. So Lonnie was like, I can sing. And they were all kind of like, you can? And she was like, probably. But she's been rehearsing with them for like a week now. And I finally got to see them play in Todd's basement today. And she's actually really amazing. I feel so proud when she's on stage. It's incredible being in awe of someone you love. So everybody knows it's like a temporary situation till she ships out in June. But till then, I'm going to be at every single show. All right, let's listen to this tape. See if I can even listen to it. Probably can't. I'm going to assume no. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's another goddamn combination that I have to find. Shit. I don't know what it is. What's this door lead to? What do you lead to, door? Oh, it doesn't work. Awesome. It's hella dark as shit. Find the light. That, that, it doesn't work. It says, oh, it doesn't Head work. Towards the light. It that, doesn't work. It's not that simple. Head towards the light. It's, it's not that simple. It's always that simple. It's not that simple. Damn thing. It doesn't want to turn on. Dark and... Shit! Alright, I'm getting out of here. Hmm. Terry, age 12. Dang. 1950s up in this joint. Alright, let's go look for this little... Secret passage over here. It's gonna be fun. Oh, I'm going upstairs. Why? Oh, I'm doing it. I'm not even on the map. Don't do it, man. It's a trap. Hey, I'm on the map. Oh, I'm in a secret room. I can room. sing. Bratmobile! <laughs> Costumes, skeletons, and devils. Cheerleaders from the Smells Like Teen Spirit video. One girl dressed as Jackie Kennedy. Psycho house girl. Coolest stuff about being the psycho house girl. Cool thing number one. Everybody in the hall thinking you don't know they're looking at you and whispering as you walk past because I guess they haven't heard of peripheral. Peripheral what? <laughs> to lie to mom and dad's situation, but it's so worth it. The girls on stage, which, oh yeah, yeah, that's the same thing. That was, yeah. So my scuff works meow. Oh, good. Good, good, good. You're What's like that? ridiculously expensive headset that, you know, I still don't know why you have. Nope. <laughs> appreciate the time whenever you wrote uh, showed initiative it was well written did not change my mind however while I understand that Miss DeSoto is a friend of yours the fact of the matter that she has defaced school property with profanity the fact that she allegedly defaced her own locker in retaliation for another student doing the same to yours is immaterial as to your complaint that no other student has been punished for the part of this incident, the fact is that no guilty party has come forward and there's been no convincing evidence to deface your locker in other words there is no one to punish Mmm. Mmm. Revenge! I get Lonnie sometimes. Like her band. Oh, right. And Scuff I'm controller. My bad. Hair and Shut up. Everything <laughs> are all anti authority. <laughs> but I watch her in JROTC, and she's doing drills in perfect formation. Following orders, no question. And there's all this stuff in the news about don't ask, don't tell. Like, she's going to join the army and then have to lie? about who she is. She said, they don't need to know what they don't need to know. Like it was no big deal. This from the girl who trashed her locker to like, defend my honor. I've learned when to stop arguing though. I don't think Lonnie even gets Lonnie sometimes. Yo, but do you really get them, man? Oh, hey, secret, uh, secret thing into the thing. Oh, one, nine, six, three. Okay, I got the combination for the thing. I'm gonna go do the thing now. You know. Go do that thing. I'm gonna go do that thing. One, nine, do six, do three. Thing. I'm gonna go do that thing. Do the thing, Julie. Show that thing. You show that thing who's boss. I'm gonna show that thing who's boss. I'm boss. Big boss.
was it one nine six three? Boom. Uh huh. Return to sender. Uh, why is the the talk the text is not showing up? Uh, this is gonna be dear sister. I uh, unite or I what something what shall be my last appeal to go unanswered one way or the other i feel a prisoner as on an island with no jailer no human for blah 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 for nothing more than the blah 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 oscar mason blah 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 love always something blah 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 okay i don't know suicide note or some shit it's like syringes and boxes and what's this box dose adults oh it's a it's morphine so yeah homie killed himself is what i got from that dang shit got dark there's like three different storylines going on right now billaron what the hell is billaron you know what billaron is nope hmm. i don't even know what is this hydrogen Water peroxide oh god no Aquatil. Dictum. Aqualung? No. The Jethro told this is not. It's a good album, though. I don't. I don't know if you're familiar with Jethro Tull, but yeah. <laughs> Boba Fett. What about Boba Fett? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You and your stupid two hundred and sixty dollar controller. Get out of here. God. <laughs> It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. You're ridiculous. Way to be ridiculous. Where are we? We are somewhere. Where are we? Read letter offer of promotion. Okay. Oh, another note. Hey, Lonnie. Sorry my mom's such a bitch last night. She's hardly ever around since her forest is like an hour away, and then when she is home, she takes it out on you... Like, because you're not a member of the family, she knows you won't call her on it, and I'm sorry. Haha, <laughs> it's okay. I know she's just jealous of our cool and freewheeling lifestyles. I feel sorry for you. I'm lucky my mom lives in Florida. You have a mom. Every. Day. Sorry, the house is making noises. <laughs> <laughs> right, like, the house is creaking behind me. I'm like, that's awkward. Stop it, house. Damn it. This is this part where spooky shit starts jumping out? Please don't be spooky shit. Alright, oh. Stub. What do we got here? Earth, Wind, and Fire. Civic Auditorium. Nice! Put that back. Wind and Fire. Where are we now? Dining room. We're in the dining room. That's where we're at. Ooh, a zine! Zines are cool. You guys remember zines? Probably not. Random Nade Ninja, what's up? How you doing? And Ron Perlman's the new character in Payday? That's pretty fucking cool. I like Ron Perlman. He's a pretty cool dude. On a scale of one to cool, he's pretty much cool. Is that another button? I feel like I'm supposed to be doing something with these buttons. warrior don't give up on this honey hmm. your manuscript sucks I'm just leaving all these lights on man you? yeah probably working at the crown burger on Bethel Road Monday Wednesday Thursday Friday 3 to 7 uh, got it open that fridge open that freezer grab that milk throw that milk grab that bottle throw that bottle Yo, fuck this ice cream! Jam? Put that right there. Alright. Open up all the pizza boxes. There's no pizza left. God damn it. <laughs> right. Daniel finally came over to get his game. I'd been dreading it. 
but he brought this story with him that I wrote when we were little. I started reading it, and then there I was, crying at the kitchen table. He asked what was wrong, and I was thinking about how we used to be friends, how much I'd taken for granted. But instead, I told him about school, and Dad, and Lonnie, and then how sorry I was that I wasn't his friend anymore. He gave me a hug and said it was going to be okay. But for some reason, I almost believed him. Dang. Way to lose contact with your buddy, your default friend. Damn, don't you feel like a bitch. Ooh, a cassette tape. What do we got here? Bratmobile. Some special. Alright. Let's see. His lines are great. Like, I remember when he yelled at a cop, he said, Put your bitch ass hands up. Yeah, I could totally hear Ron Perlman say that. Because Ron Perlman don't give no fucks. Girl, justice now. <laughs> So, more disappointing news about, uh, the father's writing career. Sam, your mother and I will be away for a long weekend celebrating our anniversary June 3rd through 7th. We will be camping in the gorge, but we will give you a call on the way home. Sorry the kitchen is still mid-renovation. Never trust a contractor. $40 is on the table to order pizza while we're gone. Be good, Dad. Why would you leave that? $40. Yes, yes, yes. 40 bucks? That's a lot of pizza. I asked Lonnie what she had to do to get ready to ship out for basic training. She said, not a lot, really. You're not allowed to bring anything with you. You have no possessions. No contact with the outside world while you're in basic. You just train hard every day, and then you deploy from there. So, they'll just send her away. <laughs> yeah. To who knows where. The other side of the country. Twenty-five bucks. The other side of the world. <laughs> My mind oh, it's the 90s. What do you expect? Can't process it. She's Shut really up. going to be gone. Just gone. Sam, the skull was the coolest thing I found in Mexico, and it was like three bucks American. I love it. Merry Christmas. Yeah, I just miss you. I just said that note too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's the. It's like, oh, you this. <laughs> oh, yeah, there it is. Uh, basement, basement, guest room. We never got a key for the attic yet, did we? No, we didn't. Nope. I'm uh, still looking. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, this? Did I go in here? A yeah, very long just, phase. Just leads out to the foyer. Okay, so that's unlocked now. Guardians, angels up above, bless this house with lots of love. Huh. Nice. All, right. All right, let's see if we can get out to uh, where the uh, greenhouse is. I'm sure we can. Somehow or another. Let's see. I'm in the dining room right now. It's the guest room. Is there another way I didn't look? Maybe? I feel like I'm missing something. Missing something. Yeah, I'm totally missing something. I totally missed this other part of the hallway here. Jesus Christ! Alright. <laughs> God damn it. Make sure I turn on all the faucets in the house. Because I'm the reason there's a drought in the future. <laughs> You're Aquaman's most. <laughs> Yes. Rival. yes, basically. <laughs> basically. Who keeps using the water? I keep using the water. The bar. <laughs> exactly. So All did right. you go to the, the table in the uh, the kitchen or in the dining room uh, and open up the uh, the folder? Yes. Hang on. Sounds like a question. <laughs> I've been touching a lot of things in this house. Folder... Ah, the one next to the zine. No. Disciplinary stuff. Note. 
Sam, since you refused to hear us out this afternoon, your mother and I are putting this in writing so that we are absolutely clear. You are grounded for the rest of the month from social and telephone uh, I don't know, privileges and from using your car for any time except going to and from school. Uh, we understand what you are going through, but we can't allow you to continue with this kind of behavior at school. And clearly, once your privileges are reinstated, we can't allow you to have your own bedroom door closed while Donnie is at the house. This is the last word on the matter. Get back on course so this won't happen again. Or, sorry, Lonnie. I had an interesting talk with Mom and Dad tonight. One you were never going to need to have. I mean... You've known, right? I've known. I've known since, like, she -Ra. Hell yeah, she -Ra. Mom and Dad didn't, I guess. <laughs> they saw the zine and the stuff on the locker, and they were like, is there something we should know about you and Lonnie? And so here's the thing. I was prepared for them to be mad, or disappointed, or start crying, or something. But they were just in Ooh. denial. You're too young to know what you want. You and Lonnie are just good friends. You just haven't met the right boy. It's a phase. That's what I didn't see coming. That they wouldn't even respect me enough to believe me. Well, joke's on them. Because they're in for one very long phase. Mm. Damn, girl. You tell them. You tell them what's up. All right, well, on that note, with a very long phase, uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, make a cut here. If you guys like the episode, feel free to hit that like button, leave a comment down below, so on and so forth, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, bye-bye. Uh, Say goodbye, Rockman. Goodbye, everyone. Bye-bye.